After launching 61 times in 2022, a yearly record to date, SpaceX is on an amazing pace through the first six months of the year. To put their achievements into perspective, in the first six months of 2023, the number of launches conducted solely by SpaceX is equal to the combined total of all other space agencies worldwide. Undoubtedly, SpaceX's accomplishments have reverberated as a seismic shock throughout the entire rocket industry, leaving industry insiders and enthusiasts alike absolutely awestruck. Find out everything about this and more in today's episode of Alpha Tech. It's really going to be close to the 100 number. Elon Musk, CEO and founder of SpaceX, announced earlier this year that the company aimed to accomplish 100 Falcon launches in 2023, a massive increase from the 61 launches achieved back in 2022. Right now, SpaceX is definitely poised to surpass its 2022 numbers, a trend they've consistently demonstrated since 2019. So how's their progress look so far? In the first half of the year, SpaceX successfully launched 44 rockets, comprised of 41 Falcon 9s, two Falcon Heavies, and one Starship. By comparison, the global space community witnessed China's performance with a total of 25 launches, predominantly executed by the Chang Zheng rocket family. While at the same time Russia, a long-standing player in the space race, fell behind with a mere nine launches, representing only one-fifth of SpaceX's impressive tally. India had four successful launches, showcasing their growing presence in the field. Europe, on the other hand, had a relatively modest showing, with just one launch during this time frame. Additionally, Japan, Israel, and Korea made their own contributions to the global launch count. In addition to SpaceX, the U.S. pioneering company behind the Falcon rockets, Rocket Labs Electron, stands as the second largest U.S. company in the rocket industry, having completed five successful launch missions. The Delta IV Heavy, renowned for its robust capabilities, had a single mission. It is worth noting that other prominent players like Blue Origin are completely absent from this list. In fact, Jeff Bezos' rocket company suffered an in-flight anomaly in 2022, which grounded its new Shepard rocket so far. Given these figures, SpaceX unquestionably retains its position as the king of the rocket industry. But can SpaceX still hit 100? To achieve 100 launches this year, SpaceX would need to launch once every 3.65 days. In the first half of the year, their launch rate was approximately one launch every 4.05 days, not including Starship. This accelerated pace has been made possible by launching nearly every week and occasionally conducting back-to-back -back or double-header launch days. Over the past few months, SpaceX has significantly intensified their operations. And although they'll have a brief hiatus until their next launch, the first weekend of July will witness another double-header of launches. One purported reason for this increased launch cadence is a new design for the second-stage nozzle, which was introduced back in April. This shorter nozzle is less efficient and can transport fewer payloads into orbit. But for certain payloads, the cost advantage outweighs the reduced efficiency. Moreover, this design reportedly enables faster production. Now, while we've become accustomed to reusing Falcon 9 first stages and payload fairings, the second stage remains expendable. By reducing the time required to construct a new second stage, SpaceX can minimize the downtime between launches. Considering the 2023 manifest, which includes 31 launches and the addition of any Starlink missions, it is plausible that SpaceX might achieve the 100 launched milestone or come very close to it. So while SpaceX is getting stronger, the rest of the rocket industry is in a crisis. Many medium and heavy launch vehicles are being retired while the remaining ones are already booked. ULA's Atlas V has sold their remaining launches, and Ariane Space has contracts for its remaining Ariane 5 flights. Mitsubishi Heavy Industries is in the same position with its H-2 vehicle, and Northrop Grumman's final flight of its Antares 230 Plus is expected this year. Vehicles such as ISRO's SLV platform are available, but will need to exceed launch rates achieved in recent years to keep pace with their orders. 
This leaves Falcon 9 and Falcon Heavy as the primary active medium in heavy launchers. To sum it up, SpaceX has made a huge contribution to the global economy. The economic impacts of SpaceX's advancements are undeniable. The global space industry has grown from $323 billion in 2018 to $345 billion in 2020, with SpaceX playing a major role in this growth. This increase in GDP is especially significant when we take in the impacts of COVID-19, which affected businesses across the globe. SpaceX has also had an indirect impact on the global economy by creating jobs and boosting the economies of the United States. The company currently employs over 10,000 workers and has plans to expand, making even more jobs. This influx of employment has helped to stimulate the U.S. economy and has enabled more people to have access to better paying jobs. SpaceX has also had a major role in the development of new technologies and advancements in the space industry. The company has launched dozens of satellites into orbit and has been involved in the development of new space exploration technologies such as reusable rockets and the Starlink satellite internet system. These accomplishments have not only increased the efficiency of space exploration, but have also opened up new economic opportunities. More importantly, SpaceX is transforming the aerospace industry as it continues to make history. The company is pioneering new space technology, setting records in reusable rocket launches, and leading the development of the commercial space industry. Since its founding in 2002, SpaceX has been pushing the boundaries of space exploration and innovation. Its first successful launch of the Falcon 1 rocket was a milestone moment in the aerospace industry and marked a new era of space exploration. In 2012, SpaceX made history again when it became the first private company to launch a spacecraft into orbit and then safely return it to Earth. Since then, SpaceX has launched a number of other rockets and spacecrafts, including the Falcon 9 and Dragon capsules. The company has also made great strides in the development of reusable rockets, launching and landing its Falcon 9 rocket at a record-breaking 25 times. This achievement has been a major breakthrough for the aerospace industry, as reusable rockets are significantly more cost-effective than traditional expendable rockets. SpaceX has also been a leader in the development of the commercial space industry. The company has made a number of agreements with both government and private entities to launch their spacecrafts. On top of that, the company has played an integral role in the development of the Crew Dragon capsule, which will take astronauts to and from the International Space Station. SpaceX has become a major disruptor in the aerospace industry, and its achievements have been nothing short of outstanding. The company's success is a testament to the power of innovation and its ability to push the boundaries of space exploration. As SpaceX continues to make history, the possibilities of what it can achieve in the future are truly exciting. The business model of SpaceX is not just beneficial to the ongoing exploration of space, but also to the long-term economic benefits of its customers. SpaceX has done more than just revolutionize space travel. It has created a new standard in the industry by offering customers more cost-effective solutions. By reusing its Falcon 9 rockets, SpaceX has been able to reduce the cost of launches by approximately 30%, making the technology more accessible to customers. This has resulted in an increased demand for SpaceX services, allowing the company to not only expand its customer base, but also to increase its revenue. Also, SpaceX's use of reusable rockets has helped reduce the production costs of spacecraft and satellites, as the components can be reused in multiple launches. This reduction in costs has enabled customers to invest more in research and development, allowing them to explore and develop new technologies in space. And finally, SpaceX's long-term economic benefits are also seen in the jobs they create. By providing employment to highly skilled engineers, technicians, and other personnel, the company has created a workforce that is capable of developing cutting-edge technologies and delivering high-quality services. In conclusion, SpaceX's business model is not only beneficial to the exploration of space, but also to the long-term economic benefits of their customers. Through its cost-effective solutions, 
reduce production costs, and employment opportunities, SpaceX has helped create a more sustainable and profitable space industry. And that just about wraps it up for today's episode. Don't forget to share your ideas in the comments section below. Everyone's support motivates us to create more quality videos. And for that, we thank you so much for watching and hope to see you next time. Bye.